Welcome back. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Okay, fantastic. All right. What is so, the other? What we are going to do? We are going to start um Java programming from scratch. We know Java fundamentals. We know basic. We know a lot of concepts. Now, actually, we are going to recap, okay? Mm -hmm. And especially today, we are working on constructor. constructor. Okay. So let me go to Java Basic, okay? And inside Java Basic, we have Java Intermediate. Actually, we are dealing with Java Intermediate today, okay? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. uh, let me create a class and I name it car, okay? Car, it's a class and I just check in public static void main. Main method. Because we want a main method, okay? Then click on finish button, and here it is, car class. Okay, how many keywords, reserved keywords in Java? Do you know? Uh, do you seven, know 67 or 67 67 67 reserved keywords in keywords. <laughs> or if you even say 50 keywords that's fine because yeah. we all know 50, but at present it's ever increasing. Every year mm -hmm. it is increasing. Oh, okay. okay, right now we have 67 keywords. Okay, mm -hmm. now what is main method? These are interview questions. Okay. What is main method? Can you tell me? The method is entry point. To execute in Java, in code. Java code. Now, what does it mean? Entry point means Without it, you cannot execute Java. We cannot program. execute, yeah. Okay. And sometimes interviewer ask question. How in brief about scopes? Mm. Okay. Now you can tell class scope starts with Class, Cali braces, okay, and and the class scope with Cali braces at the end, and we have also method scope. Every method has its scope. Starts with Cali braces and and with Cali braces and with another Cali braces. Okay, mm -hmm. no. Uh, <clears throat> Every object does have two characters. One is states and another one is behavior, right? Behavior. Behaviors. Okay. States are known as properties. What else? 
attributes okay. and fields. Yes. Okay, fields. Okay. Behaviors are known as method. Methods and functions in some um, programming language. Say, for example, in Python, we call it function. But in Java, we call it method. These are um, actually the ability of doing something, okay, mm -hmm. behavior. And properties are whatever the they object have. does have, does whatever, have. okay. Say so for example, and this will be called properties of car class. So the car can have some properties. It can be a name. Car can have a name. So for example, uh, Honda. Mm -hmm. What is the name of your car? Uh, Toyota. Toyota, okay. Toyota. Toyota is Japanese? Yeah. Toyota. Okay. Toyota. And Sienna is the model. Okay. And it can have also color. Yeah. Model, color, year. Color, say so for example, well, what is the color of your car? It is white. White, okay. All right, white. And the car has also price, right? Yeah. Price in USD? 54,000. 54. Okay, fantastic. And if you want, you can keep some more properties, but yeah. we want to complete our mission, so I want to keep it short. And car, car can have the ability to do something. Around. Car can run. Okay. So just run and parenthesis is name of the method. method. Then method has also scope mm. within the calibrations. Okay. I just type C <laughs> so and Sis. press on control space bar <clears throat> and Got just it. say um, car can run. Right. Okay. And car can have multiple methods, but I just want to keep another method. Car can stop. Stop, okay. Car can start, car can stop. And definitely the stop method does have also scope. Yeah, same thing. Okay. And we can just type C, so then press on control space bar and just say car can stop two. Okay, now if you just right button click run as Java application, actually nothing happens. Nothing happens because we have there is no object. Yeah. Yes. <clears throat> yes. There is no object. Object. So why do we create object? We create object to access all the properties and methods of class, right? Yeah. What is the purpose of creating object? We create ob object to access to the 
um, the purpose plants. of creating object okay. is to, to access, access all the properties, properties and methods of plus and methods of plus plus right okay now we have to create object right yeah how we can create object <clears throat> class name what if i just say new car is the red mark no no meaning actually this is object i created object from car class okay mm. hmm okay mm -hmm. and i can just say car c1 what i have done here the reference value c1 i just declare a variable right yeah they're variable okay now it's not complaining okay uh -huh. So we can say car C1 <laughs> reference variable and inside the reference variable, actually we can say C1 equal to new car. You see, mm -hmm. yeah. not complaining. But what we can do instead of writing double quotes, two lines, we can make it single. Make it in the single line, yeah. Okay. So, what is object here? C1 or new car? Yeah, new car. New car <clears throat> is the object. And C1 what is, is the what reference is C1? value. Reference value? It's reference variable that is referring yeah, yeah. to new car. Meaning yeah, that refers to that. By okay. C1, you are storing new car object. Right? Correct. Yes. OK. How we can copy this line? Select this line and paste. Yeah, copy and paste. Copy and paste but yeah. we have easier option. You can just uh, alter press enter. on control, control enter. enter, then down arrow mm -hmm. uh, on Windows. And if you are using MacBook, it is option commands down arrow. Down arrow. Oh, okay. Right. Now it is complaining because. If we go for work, that uh, do I need to learn how to use the MacBook? If you are using MacBook, just option command down arrow. Mm. So this is three. Say for example, right? Yeah. Now we have three different objects, oh. but it seems similar. It seems new car, new car, new car, same object. Yeah. Apparently, apparently, it seems it is same. They are same, but in practically, they are different. Different. They're they strange, different. different. If you print it, sorry. So. Control space bar, okay, mm. and just copy and just print C1, C2, C3, yeah. and check they are not similar. Uh -huh. You see, mm. it is inside Java Intermediate then dot car is the class and their memory path is different, mm -hmm. same. different. not same 
not same. If you even create million objects, millions object will be different. Mm -hmm. No one, no single object will be similar. Okay? Now, mm -hmm. how we access all the properties and methods of a class, how we can access them. We just use the reference value, reference variable. Reference variable, okay. Yeah, just anyone. We can take anyone. Just, just okay. Just I say C1 dot dot name now you can access anyone what do you want okay and if i say if, if i do the uh c2 name is gonna be the same thing yes same mm -hmm. thing let's see so control space bar c2 name yeah and even if you choose uh, C3, it will print Toyota three times, right? Three times, yeah. Now, what is the problem if we print Toyota three times, meaning Actually, we have different object, but three different object all are printing same name. Mm. That's the limitation of declaring variable, defining variable, and creating object and accessing the properties and methods with reference variable. So actually this car name object, new object, this three different object car definitely can be different car. One can be Toyota, another one can be Honda, another can be Tesla, but we cannot solve the problem with default constructor. Constructor is there, but still, it cannot solve our problem. To solve the problem, we have to use constructor for this class. We have to create the constructor, okay? How we can create constructor? We can create constructor Thus, we can say public the same name, car and car, you see, same name. Then parenthesis. So this is constructor. Look, this constructor also method. It is special kind of method. It's not very similar to this method, okay? Why it is special? Because you cannot name it as you wish. Constructor mm -hmm. method must be named same as class, class. Mm -hmm. okay? So this is constructor.
created from plus. Mm. Okay. But these methods are not created from class. No. Definitely, definitely, these are behavior coming from object. Okay. And these methods are methods of the class. These properties are properties of the class, all right? But this is very different method. This is special method. We call it let me make multi-line comments. Constructor is a special kind of method. Okay. Why constructor is used? Constructor is used to initialize or set the value okay now look here we set the value the variable we declare then we define it is Toyota. Yeah. But what if the values are not defined? We just declare the variable, but the values are not defined. We still don't know the name of the car. Okay. Mm -hmm. We still don't know the color of the car. We still don't know the uh, price of the car. Okay. So in that case, we have to create constructor okay this is very important concept in java okay and usually usually we declare these properties here okay then we create constructor Understand mm. what we are going to do. We are going to tell the car method that it does have parameter. It is string name, string color, and integer price in USD. Now, it seems, look very carefully, it seems this name is this name, right? This color is this color. 
and this price is this price. It looked like similar, right? Hmm. But in reality, it is not. This name is not this name. This color is not this color. And this price is not this price. Because if you look at the scope, these properties are properties of the car plus, and it is inside a class scope. This inside the class, right? Yeah. Scope. But this is also inside the class, but they are inside the method. Uh, yeah. When it is inside the method, we call them parameter. Mm. So these are parameter. Parameters. Parameter, parameter one, parameter two, and this is parameter three. You understand it? Mm. These are called variable. This is bar one, variable one. This is bar two. This is bar three. So these are called variable. These are called parameter, okay? But this is also variable, okay? This name can be varied, color can be varied, price can be varied. So these are also variable, but we call them parameter when, when we use the, the parenthesis. Point. Uh, inside the method. Clear? Is it clear? Yeah. So these two are not same. Apparently, it seems same, but not same. Now, how I can understand now, if I just write name equal to name how hmm. i will know which name is this name how i will know which of these two name is this name can you understand me mm, yeah which one is this name between these two Second one or the first one? Mm -hmm. Confusing, right? Yeah. If you click here, okay, if you click here, it's not selecting anyone. Mm. If you click here, you see it's selecting this one, okay? And also it is selecting this one. Now, if you click here, actually not showing which one is this but if you click here you see it's selecting this one that and also good. if you click here it's also selecting this one now how you will distinguish or differentiate between this two one is parameter another one is variable hmm. both are definitely variable Okay, and uh, I can say this dot name. Now, look, it's selecting this one. Yeah. So this is this one. This means it is indicating to the class level. Okay. Mm. And this one is this one. Okay. Now you can say this dot color equal to color. And you can say this 
price in USD equal to price in USD, right? Mm. Okay, now look, it will print now different names, okay? It will print now different names. Now, look. Let me just make it a little space so that you can see this one. Okay, maybe I have to take it out. If you need the notes, I can keep it somewhere, maybe. Okay, now it will be easier for you to understand, I believe. Like, now look, this name is going to be the first parameter, is this one, and Actually, this name is going to be here, okay? Then comma, then going to be the color up to the comma. Then comma, again, it's going to be here, the price, okay? Now, let me just put everything together name is say for example name of the car is Toyota and color is white and price is 55k right Hmm. No complaint. But these two are complaining because still we didn't put the value for the these parameters. The color price name. So I can say this is maybe Hunda. Okay. And color is red. can be small or capital cap, no worries. And price is a little less, maybe. Honda. I'm not sure. And the final one is Tesla. And it is blue. And price is 65K. I'm not sure the price. Mm. It's a little more, right? A little more if is it Model X or something, right? Okay, now look. It's printing the name, three different names, you see? So the problem is solved. It's not printing the same name. Uh, same thing, yeah. Not same, same. And if you again copy you can now print the color. Okay. You can print the color and you can print the color 
and finally price in USD price in USD though using same variable it's giving you a different output right hmm. now look this is the beauty <clears throat> of using constructor hmm. so very powerful concept and definitely you have to face the interview why you are using constructor what is constructor okay mm -hmm. and you have to tell constructor name must be same as the class okay and it is special method And the purpose of creating object is to not object. Purpose of creating constructor is constructor is uh, initialize getting the... or set the values. Uh. And another very specialty of constructor is. Constructor method is invoked or called when object is created. Invoked, 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 invoked. Invoked means called. Meaning, whenever you create object, new object, constructor is automatically called. This is method, right? Mm. In method, like in method, you know, method is a block of codes that only executes or invokes executes invokes or calls What does it mean? Method is a block of code that only executes or run when it is called. called. Okay. Hmm. When it is called by name. By name. You have to call by name. Say, for example, this run, you want to uh, call run method. Hmm. Thus, you can say reference variable. C1 dot dot run run so you are using c3 maybe uh, stop right so you are calling it by name right you are calling by name my name yeah if you don't call them by name they can't come yeah they will not be 